everyone has been speculating that DDG and Hallie may have had their baby. Well, DDG was asked a question on Snapchat. The question was, does he have a daughter? And this was DDG's response. No. Bro, I don't know why it, why people is like so invested in what I got going on or what we got going on. Like, bro, mind your business. Like, Go outside, touch some grass, bro. Like, like, go do a cartwheel in your backyard or something. Like, it's it's weird, bro. Like, I don't, I genuinely don't be understanding. It's like, bro, why do y'all be so invested in people that don't know you? Like, I ain't gonna lie. Like, I love my supporters and shit, but in real life, bro, I don't know you. <laughs> like, I. I I, that's just the truth. Like, you got to just let me live my life. Like, you don't go up, you don't look at your principal at your school and be like, damn, is she in a bad mood today? Did she argue with her dude today? What's going on with her today? Like, bro, why do you care so much? Whatever's going on in my life or her life, bro, is not going to change yours. That's and believe, bro. Work, work in the, get, get in the lab. Go get some money. Like let's let's focus on ourselves. Twenty twenty four, bro. Let's try to lock in on ourselves, not other people. Please. So he said he didn't have a daughter, but that doesn't mean he doesn't have a son. But let's move on to this next topic with Nooney. Now I previously reported that she exposed that Jazz and Jay Long pulled out a weapon on them. Came up. I mean, she was staying in the room or whatever. I went back out. Went left out the room. And then that's when everybody started arguing a little bit more. People was throwing shots and then my loud, my quiet ass started yelling. But it, that's why I say everybody played a part. But I was talking shit. Next thing you know, um, Jazz going wrong. And that's when it escalated. Whenever I started talking, cause baby, they didn't like that when I said. Jazz went in her room, grabbed her strap and tucked it in her panties. Right along with Jay Long. And I was just like, oh, so she trying to, what she trying to do with that? So I went up to Flo, I'm like, Flo, get this girl, like, why she got a gun? He ain't, he ain't do nothing, he ain't do enough. He did something, I don't know what he did, he was just scrambling. I was like, you ain't do enough, my boy. So now Jazz tweeted, never gossip, focus on success. Someone responds with, so she just gonna act like we ain't just find out her and Jay Long pulling out on females jazz responds with i'm a female myself one thing i'ma do is use my second amendment once i tell an mf to leave my house i pay rent for so then jay long went on to explain his side of the story on what happened that night but i came out to jazz arguing with people and and first off if i if i have guests in my house I refuse for a guest to be arguing back with me. And if I say, get out, get out. So as I came outside, I just heard Jazz saying, get out. Yeah, everybody get out of my house. Y'all get out of my house. Y'all are guests. You know what I'm saying? I guess Jazz and Crystal was arguing at that time or some, whatever it may be. Uh, I don't know. I think Jazz said something to them on the couch about get out. But bro, they refused to get out the crib. Like, and I'm just sitting there like, bro, y'all just leave. If Jazz say leave, y'all just leave. But a gun tucked in a, in, in, in means of saying like get out of my house standing on business like come on now let, let's be real somebody ain't getting at your house no you're not gonna shoot them no you're not gonna do nothing but you're gonna scare them a little bit bro y'all get the fuck out of my house i said get out of my house get out of my house what i look like calling 911 what i look like doing any of that that's just straight up you know what i'm saying like that's just straight up so things escalated it's a bunch of stuff going on i guess Flo and Nooney start arguing i don't i can't remember and i'm not finna lie so i'm not even finna say much Cause I don't, that's not, that's not me. But I, I know damn well for sure. My energy kicked up and turned up because I heard a location was dropped to the house. I heard a location was dropped to the house because of all the arguing that was going on. Noonie, Noonie, I guess she was finna drop the location or she, no, she did drop the location. She dropped the location to the crib. And anybody like me, nigga, I'm, I'm on 10, bro. I'm not finna sit here and let none of that happen. Like, what? I, I don't know Nooney, but I've heard of her background. She had two exes that passed away because of violence. What the fuck? I'm finna sit here and, and let anything slide. Of that avenue, of that 
caliber. Y'all not dropping no Eddie's. No, this is not what's happening. None of that. So once I heard that, Flo came in the house and said, oh, shit, she dropped the Eddie. I grabbed my Of course, I grabbed my gun. We're not going to do that. Let's clear this up right now. No gun was pointed at nobody. I'm not no stupid fool. What I look like pointing a gun at a female, number one. What do I look like, what do I look like pointing? A female number one y'all let's just clear all this shit up bro because it's making me mad and i don't even i'm not even that type of person y'all know me in the most humblest way i stay in my lane i do what i gotta do i post my videos i go work out bro i just i just be and it appears that Armand and Regine have not made things official official after Regine was in the comment section of a live stating that she is single. Now, a few days ago, people were getting on Armand after he after he retweeted and responded to a tweet from an adult entertainer. People were saying things like, reposting this while you're in a relationship is high key disrespectful, shaking my head. I just hope you will be cool with your girl reposting some ish like this. So I'm not sure what happened here. I do know on that 20 versus one R&B singer that Trey did, Trey did state that Armand was focused on Regine, but Regine is claiming that she's single. So not sure if they're still working on a relationship or if they decided not to work on things anymore. But let's move on to this next topic with CJ So Cool. So you guys know Christmas just passed and he gave out gifts to both Nike and of course his girlfriend Lexi. Well, according to Tavi, Lexi wasn't too happy that Nike got a bigger purse than her. <laughs> Let me see. Ooh, I got more likes than I got people in here, man. <laughs> this is crazy. Okay, y'all, here a little boom. Christmas Eve. We all at CJ house. He want everybody to open up their gifts. Ooh, thank you, D Price. Thank you. I appreciate it. Everybody opening up their gifts. Boom. So one person opened up their gift. All the kids opened up their gift. But somebody else didn't open up their gift. Boom, Christmas, Christmas Day come. <laughs> Christmas Day come. The last person opened up their gift, and baby. Missing her. TNT. What? Anti, what I do? 